So if you have a good family, if you have a good family and you have good parents who did the best to look after you and nurture you and grow up in, you know what I'm saying, and, and do the best things to set you up in life, you know, for most of us, of course there are some that are exceptional, so for most of us, no matter how hard working our parents were, they're not going to be able to guide us tr truly and thoroughly in, in, today's, in today's world because the gap is so big, right? I think this is probably the first time in human history where the gap between generations is just so huge because there have been so many technological advancements, so many new ideologies, society has changed so much. Just when we were growing up, our parents didn't have YouTube, our parents didn't have social media, our parents didn't have all these things, right? So they won't be able to thoroughly guide us and give us the examples and things that we need and, and, and tell, tell us the way on how to make money. Not making money has changed. The way people make money has changed, right? And so you need to come to the realization that your parents are not always going to be able to tell you to make the right decisions that are best for you. I'll give an example. Back in the day, if you wanted to find a good girl, you just go to a good place or the library and, and, and you just date. You just date. You just date her. And that's it. You're set. You're set, right? Nowadays, instead, if you want to have a good relationship or you want to find a good girl, you kind of have to be a player. You have to. You have to go through chick after chick after chick after chick after chick until you find one that you think is suitable for you. And that's just the nature of the game today. But your parents will probably give you a different advice. If you want to get rich or you want to get wealthy, you know what I'm saying? Back in the day, you could then go to a job and then climb your way up the ladder, right? Climb your way up the ladder and then eventually you'd get to the top and become the big boss and make all the big money. Nowadays, it's different. Because most people don't even stay at the job for two, three years. So you're constantly switching and switching jobs, right? Um, there's things like social media, which you can use to make money. All these things. So things have changed. And our parents haven't been able to catch up. If, they're, uh, if, you're, if you're my age, if you're like 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 24, I'm 25, right? So th things have changed and they're not going to be able to guide you and tell you the right choices to make. Marriage is different. It's, it's a, a very, very, it's, it's very financially risky. Things like that, guys. We have to be, we have to be honest with ourselves. And it doesn't mean that they're failing, you, they're failing you or they failed you. It simply means that they were born in a different time. And they had different lessons and different ways to achieve and different paths to achieve success. You're born in a different time. You're, you're born in the era of information. So you're going to have to learn that you have to fill the gaps with internet, YouTube, uh, Google, and whatever. And you're also going to have to know that not everything that they tell you, probably most things that they tell you on how to navigate life are probably going to be wrong. And that's just the way it is. But that's perfect for you because you're on a self-improvement journey, right? You're trying to become your own man. And that means that in life, you're going to have to make your own decisions, right? You're going to have to make your own decisions and stick to them. You're going to have to find the path that works best for you. So at the end of the day, it's not really a bad thing. It's probably a good thing because it's going to start forming your character and you're going to start becoming the individual that you want. I remember going on a, wanted to go, wanting to travel at 19 and go out abroad. And I'm so happy I did that, but my family was so against it. They're like, oh, it's dangerous, things like that. But probably when they were growing up, it was probably dangerous to travel. There was no internet. There was no Google Maps, all these things. But I'm happy I did that. I'm happy I got to travel because I wouldn't be the person I am. I'm happy that I made all those experiences and they enriched me. And I look back and I'm so glad that I didn't listen to them. But they were probably looking in my best interest because maybe in the 1950s, it was dangerous to travel. Who knows? You get what I'm saying? So... Make your own decision and just realize that your parents won't be able to help you all the way through your process. And that's just life. That's just the way the world that we're living in right now. But it's okay. You have channels like, like me who are going to tell you about mistakes and how to level up and show you, show, show, show you as I do that. And you're also going to have uh, other, 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 other things. Right? Everyone, everyone has their own niche. Everyone has their own sector. So I'm sure you'll be able to find the answers that you're looking for if you're willing to look for them. It's time to hit those fitness goals of yours and sculpt the body of your dreams. Apply at the link in the description.